Lead poisoning is considered the most preventable environmental disease among children. Even at low levels, children's intelligence, hearing, and growth can be permanently damaged. There is no safe level of lead. But where does lead come from? Lead is naturally found deep within the ground, but also can be found in a variety of everyday things. When ingested or inhaled, lead affects nearly every organ in our body. Kids under age six are especially at risk because they are still developing. They put everything in their mouths and they absorb lead easily into their bodies. And lead can be found in more things than just lead-based paint. Kids can be exposed to lead if someone in the home works in plumbing repair, construction, or welding. Adults working in these occupations could potentially take home lead on their clothes, shoes, work items, and skin. Some hobbies including hunting or shooting guns, using artist paints, or refinishing furniture may expose you to lead as well. Lead can be found in water, soil, and dust. Toys, jewelry, or imported goods such as makeup, glazed pottery, spices like turmeric, and Mexican candy made with chili powder or tamarind all may contain lead. Home remedies and Ayurvedic medicines such as Azarkan, Greta, or Pelua that are used to treat various ailments in kids may contain lead. How can I help prevent my child from being exposed to lead? Reduce exposure to contaminated dirt and dust by washing your child's hands, keeping shoes outside, and using a vacuum with a HEPA filter. You can also limit exposure to dust that may contain lead by using a wet mop in your home instead of a broom. A diet that's high in calcium, iron, and vitamin C can also help protect children from lead poisoning. How would I know if my child was exposed to lead? Headaches, stomach aches, nausea, tiredness, and irritability are all symptoms of lead poisoning. However, children do not always show signs of illness until their levels are very high. How can I find out if my child was exposed to lead? The only way to know if a child has lead poisoning is through a blood test. All children should be evaluated by their healthcare provider for their risk of lead poisoning at 12 and 24 months of age. Children living in high-risk zip codes should also get a blood test. Want to know if your child is at risk for lead poisoning? Use the lead risk map to see if you're in a high-risk zip code. If your child has been identified with an elevated blood level, remove or reduce exposure to the source of lead and schedule a follow-up test to ensure that lead is leaving the body. Childhood lead poisoning is dangerous, but can be prevented. For more information and resources on lead poisoning and how to prevent it, please visit azhealth.gov lead or call 602-364-3118.